when four officers are pinning me down on the ground, I believe my aggression is so that I can protect myself. Because I am going through this, I'm mentally unstable. Penny's diagnosis is schizophrenia and bipolar disorder. For us, it's just scary because, um, you know, like when she's having like a mental health episode, she was telling us that she sees people's eyes and their pupils are all dark. So it really makes her see us as a villain instead of people who need to help her. Even though I had that fear, they approached me in a certain way where it's like, we're gonna get the help that you need. For us as a family, we want her to be safe. She needed medical care. That was our hopes in calling 911. Police are being deployed with a law enforcement mindset. They're arriving at the scene with a particular demeanor. When someone is dealing with a mental health episode, if they're seeing their own family members as people that are trying to attack them, imagine somebody showing up with a gun and a badge. Because I am going through this, I'm mentally unstable. I had like a lot of anger. And when the police would have approached me, I would only show that anger towards them. Police are arriving armed, uniformed, their objective is to contain and control the situation. I felt fear. I felt in danger since I would be seeing things that um, no, no one else is seeing. We hear from police officers that they are not trained as mental health workers. When we do call, it's, it's literally like hit or miss. It's like either we're going to get the police um, to actually send her to jail or we're gonna get an ambulance to send my sister to a hospital. Once I'm in the system, I am treated as a criminal and not someone that needs mental health care. MSERT refers to our mobile crisis rapid response team. We have crisis workers who are registered health professionals who are riding with uniformed officers in police cruisers responding to live 911 calls that involve mental health crises. The vast majority of the calls for service have elements of mental health and addiction. Many of those calls are not criminal in nature and we recognize that we had to partner with the mental health experts in our community so that we can deliver the most suitable, most appropriate, and most immediate support for those that were going through personal crisis. Having a clinician in the team is always helpful because we have that, that experience, we have that skill set to understand where the client is when they are in a crisis. So we are able to assess the situation by asking the right kind of question and thereby we will be able to build a rapport with the client. Prior to the launch of MSERT in 2019, the apprehension rate for just police officers attending mental health related calls were approximately 90%. While we have seen a lot of success in the decrease of apprehensions when an MSERT team is involved, the reality is they can only respond to a small fraction of the total amount of mental health related calls that we go to. The MSERT model is that you should have one team per 250,000 residents. And given the size of Peel Region, we really should have closer to eight teams when we really have two. I am consistent on my medication and I'm not using drugs and alcohol. I don't have that frustration anymore. I don't want to hold anything against any officer that has hurt me. I just want to be at peace.